Percy, time to wake up. Percy? Huh. Maybe he's in the kitchen eating already. Where's Alex? Alex, where are you? Alex isn't here right now. Who said that? Someone who wants to know the truth. Or more like a person who wants you to know the truth. The truth? The truth about what? The truth about our two realms and how they are connected. But I know that history already. Yes, but you don't know the whole truth. Over time, history gets changed and twisted to one side's liking. And you expect me to believe you know the whole truth? No, not even I know the whole truth. But if we combine our stories, then the truth is bound to be somewhere in there. Why should I trust you? Because I know how to get to the Enchanted Forest. No, you're lying. Oh, but it's true, Percy. We've had a way to the Enchanted Forest for over a thousand years. But we need your help to get there. You are the key, Percy. I might feel a little more comfortable about helping you if I knew who you were. Mr. Walker? I must give you credit, Percy. You made it quite difficult to confirm that you were a wolf, seeing as you learned how to hide your ears and tail. That was just pure luck. But now I'm gonna need you to show them to me. Okay, unstrap me so I can pull down my pants and show you my tail. You and I both know that's not how it works, Percy. Now why don't you cooperate with us, so we can get this over with? I still don't fully trust you, because you don't seem like the trustworthy type. Fine then. Let me introduce myself. My name is Harold Walker. I'm from the long lineage of King Harold IV, the very same king from the story. Now that I know who you are, how does that pertain to me showing you my ears and tail? Because the only way to get to the Enchanted Forest is to get the essence of the wolf. Which we can only get if you have your ears and tail out. Essence of the wolf? Yes. Part of what makes you... Well, you. Don't worry though. It doesn't hurt. And it doesn't change who you are. Do you just need to pluck a piece of fur or take some blood? It's a bit more complicated than that. But you can get me home? We can open the portal to the Enchanted Forest. Well, alright then. Let's do it. <laughs> Good. Now if you will follow me to the extraction chamber. Extraction chamber. Sounds pleasant enough. It will extract your essence and bottle it up. Then we can use the essence to open the gate. Why do you want to open it so badly? I merely want to help you get home, Percy. And I wish to study the forest. You might say... I'm curious. Well, why kidnap me rather than just asking nicely? I didn't think you'd be so easily persuaded. Give me one moment. 
Prepare the extraction chamber. Also, get a body bag ready. We'll need it. Now, follow me, Percy. We'll get you prepared. Percy? Percy, are you here? Percy! Percy, where are you? This isn't funny anymore. What are you doing? I'm looking for Percy. You haven't seen him anywhere, have you? Nope. Are you sure he's not in his room? That's the first place I looked, you dummy. Well, I'm sure he's around here somewhere. I hope so. I hope he's doing alright. I'm positive he's alright. What makes you say that? Are you sure you don't know where he is? He was in the bathroom. He asked me to take Percy's hat off. He paid me. Did you pay Marcus to take Percy's hat off when we had our date? No. What would make you think that? Just something Marcus said. He said you were in the bathroom when you approached him. I don't know why he would say that. <laughs> I've never even been in that restaurant before. Oh. Okay. Wait. I never said we went to a restaurant. Oh, uh, are you sure? I'm pretty sure you said you were going to a restaurant. No. I said we were going on a date. I never said where. Well, I'm pretty sure you said- Where's Percy, Alex? Let go of me, or you're grounded. Ground me all you want. But tell me where Percy is. Elizabeth Marie Waters. Let go of me and go to your room. Ew. Don't use my full name, Alexander. Let go of me and I won't anymore. Just tell me where he is, Alex. I know something is up with you, so you need to start explaining. I don't know where he is, so stop asking. Ugh. Fine. I'll go find him myself. Come in. Hey, Liza, what's up? I'm freaking out here. Why, is it that time? What? Ew, no. Oh, then what's wrong? I'm trying to find Percy, but I've looked everywhere and don't know where he is. Well, why don't you just ask Alex? I already did. He claims he hasn't seen him. Oh, uh, well, I saw him with Percy in the city earlier today. What? I saw Alex and Percy walking together in the city. I thought it was just weird that you weren't there. Alexander, you better tell me where he is! I... Don't lie to me! I can't tell you where he is! Why not? Just trust me. How could I possibly trust you after you just lied to my face? Please. Liza, calm down. Don't tell me to calm down. Percy's missing. My brother's lying to me. I don't know what the hell is going on anymore. There's no need to yell at me, Liza. You're, you're right. I'm sorry, Amanda. Good. Now let's go get Percy. But we don't know where he is. And Alex won't say. 
I saw the building that they went into. I can take you there. Thank you. You are a lifesaver. As for you, I'll deal with you when I get back. Please don't go. Shut your mouth, Alex. You've no right to speak with me anymore. Let's go, Amanda. Let go of me! You don't know what you're dealing with. I can take care of myself! I don't want you to get hurt. You already hurt me, Alex. You were my brother. You're supposed to be the one person who's always there for me. But instead you betrayed me. I'm sorry. If you're sorry, then tell me what you're dealing with. I wish I knew. But they wouldn't tell me what they wanted Percy for. Who is they? Some man. He calls himself Walker. He needed a wolf for something, but I didn't know what. What? Wait. You know Percy's a wolf? Yes, I know. Oh, great! Just another thing you lied about. I was just trying to protect you. They said they'd hurt you if I didn't listen. If you wanted to protect me, then you should have told us what was going on. But now, you've put Percy in danger. Who knows what they'll do to him? Let's go, Liza. We're wasting time. All right. Take me where they were. Please be safe. This is what we waited for. No looking back.